Hi guys, it's nice to see you again. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in today. So today I'm back with another makeup tutorial for you and it's going to be this look right here. Very smoky, very fall appropriate. Uh, and I'm going to achieve this look using this Deck of Scarlet palette. First of all, I want to tell you a little bit about uh, what Deck of Scarlet is. It's a subscription uh, service. But instead of getting a bunch of different brands or a bunch of different products, you get uh, the same brand and every other month they collaborate with some Instagram person or YouTuber and they come up with um, a different eyeshadow palette, with different uh, lip looks and everything that you will need to achieve uh, two or three very particular looks. And subscription costs $29.95. You can skip if you do not like the palette that they are coming up next. Um, with no charge or you can cancel it at any time. Every other month, a uh, different palette and different kit for different looks. So this is what you get inside. Um, it's a little card. Uh, this month they're collaborating with um, Mili Sanchez and this is her little note. And then here is the palette. And then uh, you get another product. It's a uh, lip crayon. I'm going to open it up for you so it has a little um, sleeve. The uh, package feels very heavy and nice and it kinda, um, it's kind of rubbery. So it will be easy to clean. So it has like a two sides of it. The first one uh, is the eyeshadow and the blush and uh, highlight. And the second side is the uh, lipsticks. I already used it, that's why it looks like this. <laughs> but anyway, so um, the shades are very pigmented and bright and you will see it during this tutorial. So I'm very excited to show you this, so let's begin. And if you would like to see how I achieve this look, then please keep watching. First of all, I'm going to apply the shade Adorable with my Morphe M433 brush in my crease. So this is going to be our transition color. You can also use it overall, like I find this palette to be so versatile, although it means to be uh, for like only two or three looks, but with fall coming, this is perfect shade, honestly. Now with my flat brush, I'm going to use the shade New York, I'm going to apply it all over the leaf. Oh my gosh, it's so smoky. Oh yeah. Just look at that. You just pick up so much more pigment with your with your finger. I know it's not probably very sanitary, but who cares? I'm going to add a little more of this adorable shade in my crease, blend the gray shade out just a tiny bit with it. For my bottom lash line, I'm going to use this uh, shade Sagittarius, and you can use any flat top brush. Now with the same brush uh, that we put the lighter shade in the crease, I'm going to diffuse this uh, bottom lash line. And now with the same Morphe M433 brush, I'm going to apply a little bit of this Sagittarius shade um, on my outer corners. Just to deepen them, add a little bit of a dimension, some drama. We're going out, we're going full out so now with my Morphe M151 uh, brush I'm going to put this diamond dust it's a uh, um, very shimmery silver shade I'm going to pop it in my inner corners and now I, I uh, wipe this brush a little bit and with the same brush I'm going to put this shade Pinot Grigio um, I'm going to um, use it as my brow bone highlighter. So now I'm going to align my waterline with this Urban Decay 24-7 uh, Glide on Eye Pencil. And just make like a little baby wing right here. So now with my Morphe M207 brush, 
I'm going to pick up uh, the same uh, New York shade and I'm going to go over the uh, eyeliner just to um, blend it out a little bit because I wanna I wanna uh, smudge eyeliner look. I don't want like sharp anything today. So now I'm going over uh, with this Sagittarius shade and with the flat brush. I'm going over my um, lower lash line. For blush today, I'm using the same shade, Adorable, and I'm going to apply it with my Morphe S24 brush. I love that you can use them as eyeshadows and blushes and highlighters. For highlighter, I'm using this uh, shade Pinot Grigio, and I'm going to apply it with my um, um, with my Tarte brush. Oh yeah. So uh, this palette also comes with these two shades on the lipsticks. It's uh, Sasha and Maria. I can swatch that for you. <gasps> oh damn. You know what? Do not. Do, I thought it's uh, like an Anastasia lips, like lipstick palette. But do not dip your finger in there. See? Just use a little bit on the tip of your brush. So this is how they look. And it also comes with this stick, it's called One Stroke Graphic Lip Crayon. Um, I believe one side possibly it's like a lip lipstick and one side is like a lip liner. I'm going to use a lip liner. Now I'm going to put a little bit of this darker shade with this uh, crayon. Uh, on my outer corners. And now with some like illusion of volume. In the center, I'm going to add uh, some of this uh, Sasha shade. I'm going to take like a little dot. Here. For mascara, I'm using L'Oreal Telescopic in shade Carbon Black. I'm going to do just one coat on my top lashes and a couple of coats on the bottom. What a difference mascara makes, huh? That's a trip how eyelashes and eyebrows frame our face. And for lashes, I'm using Ardell 600 Black. And this is it for today's look. I hope you enjoyed watching this makeup tutorial. And if you did, then please give me your thumbs up because I really, really appreciate it. And also hit that subscribe button before you go because that also helps me out a lot. And until the next time, I will see you guys soon. Bye!